Hey guys, uh, Kamil here. In this video I want to tell you why I think that no one can really show you your, the best way to your success. People can guide you and help you, but no one can really show you and tell you, yeah, this is what you uh, need to do and how you need to do it, like every step. Now, let me tell you why. I was in inspired, let's say, or I, was, um, I got this idea reading uh, this book, uh, Driving uh, the Tiger, um, the High Growth Company. So it's a book about how uh, high growth companies operate, how they are, uh, you know, what's the mechanism behind it. But anyway, so what the guy says in this book that uh, he's a Swedish guy, Thomas uh, Achrens, or however you, you uh, are supposed to read uh, his uh, name. Um, so he says that very often he, he could see there are people analyzing uh, a company's success uh, a few, and then they're looking a few years back then and then think about kind of backwards engineer the whole strategy. How did the company create the strategy for success? And, and many people do that. And he reckons it's a really bad approach because you, how strategies are created, what he discovered is right there and then. So when the company is growing, uh, people you know who are driving the company, they meet together, they brainstorm, and based on the uh, knowledge and also on their feelings, their intuition, they create a strategy. And, and, it go, and it goes on and on and on all the time. And then someone, 10 years later, looks back and says, oh yeah, the strategy was to, this, to do this, this and that, but he reckons it's a bad approach. And I'm thinking, this is probably correct. And also it's correct with our own uh, personal success because I understand that someone who's done something that I want to achieve will help me tremendously in achieving that, but I need to use my intuition and my feeling about how I really want to drive it. Do I really want to go slightly left or sl slightly right or maybe change the advisor and do something else or maybe quit this thing completely and do something different? You know, I need to use my own feelings. That, that's, that's, um, uh, that was my revelation uh, when, which I got from this uh, book. Now, what, what's your opinion? Do you think that this might be right? You know, that we need to find this um, perfect balance between our intuition and knowledge and experience. So we we get um, knowledge and experience from other people, especially those who, who have done the things that we want to do, and then we should uh, f mix it with our own intuition. Do you think that that's the best approach? Because I think that is the best approach, and no one can really tell us, yeah, this is definitely the best way to do it, or this is the best way forward. It might be the best for them, but not necessarily for you. So, if you haven't succeeded in your life, and you've been following certain step-by-step -step processes, and they didn't work for you, don't worry, because that's the way it is. And uh, I hope that was uh, uh, eye-opening for you. And um, see you in the next video. <laughs> Take care.